that area. Laundry room. Okay, it's like a living space. One of the abandoned, I guess. Yeah, not closed off area, but this kitchen definitely isn't my favorite, but I would paint the cabinets. Area. That bathroom stinks. Here's the master. Nice big soaker tub down the hallway. Oh, that is cool. These two rooms connect. Here's the pool. Okay, the this. garage is below. Here's the other bedroom. There's six bedrooms, so five upstairs, the one downstairs. The like, really, yard is very, very a small. Lot of light down there. Yeah, a lot of good lighting. The tall ceiling. Here is the backyard. Oh, it does have an awning. That's nice. The side yard. Could potentially turn that into grass, maybe. Oh, yeah. A little water view back there. <laughs> Just leaving both of the houses and the first one I really loved. It had everything that we need. Um, the yard is smaller than I wanted, but like space wise, it was perfect. And it felt like they took good care of the house, even though it was older, everything just looked really nice. But Dwayne just wasn't 100% sold. He didn't love the outside of it that much. And then the second house, it had a gorgeous pool. I mean, the backyard was beautiful, but there was no space for the dogs. Like the whole yard is a pool. And then the inside just had a very weird smell. Like I definitely think someone smoked in the house. And then like the bathroom had like almost like a moldy water smell to it. I don't know. I just had a weird vibe walking in there and something's just telling me like it's not the one. So it really stinks because we loved that one, but it is over our budget. So if we're gonna go over our budget, it has to feel like the right house and it just didn't have that feeling. So